hey everybody welcome back to my youtube channel i pray that you guys are doing well um i just wanted to come on and do a little little quick video of something that i was thinking about um and then i'm gonna just let y'all go i'm gonna have let y'all have the rest of y'all day but before we get into the video i'm gonna pray real quick thank you god for your listeners god thank you for every person that presses play on these videos god i pray that it's touching them in some way and that it is encouraging them father to grow closer to you one and to take the things that we're saying on here father god because you speak through me and to help them grow their business father so we love you god and we honor you for being our dad we love you so much god and we thank you for all that you're doing in our lives god and so in jesus name i pray that you would decrease me and increase all of you amen so as i was driving i always be thinking and talking and praising and worshiping and everything while i'm in this car this is like my sanctuary um and so as i was driving god was reminding me of something that i wrote in my book about how you got to be around the people with the money like that i feel like that was the game changer for me um in chapter two of my book i talk a lot about um the move and god moved me from what the shop that i was in to another shop and this shop that it, that he moved me to everybody in there was making money the shop i came from everybody was not making money so sometimes you got to be around not even gonna say sometimes all the times you have to position yourself and place yourself in a position to be around the people that have money you know there's a saying that um what i forgot how it goes it's, it's in i think it's in the bible too where it talks about good or bad habits corrupt corrupts good judgment or something like that so if you're around people that's that have bad habits bad spending money um you never see them prospering you never see them being able to purchase a house or you never see them being able to have good credit it's just a lot of different things that you noticed about them and you're like dag we all in the same boat i need to get around some people that actually have the things that i'm trying to obtain and it seems so simple but sometimes it's hard to let people go it's hard to let people places and things go because we're comfortable right we get so comfortable being around these people we don't and then sometimes like if you're anything like me you're afraid you're afraid to do better you're afraid that people are gonna talk about you be like oh who she thinks she is now oh she arrived you know you get afraid of that so you just stay in your little shell you stay comfortable you don't grow you don't you don't change you don't start doing better for yourself because you just don't want to hear what people have to say about you well guess what time is out for all that so do what you got to do for you because at the end of the day the same people that are going to talk about you are the same people that if they had your skill if they had your confidence if they had your looks if they had all of the things that you have they would definitely be wanting to do better you know what i'm saying so do better and you may motivate them to come along but it's not your job to stay low it's not your job to not do better for yourself to appease other people that's not your job your job is to pray and ask god to help you you know prosper because that's what he wants for you your job is to ask him where does he want you to go which shop does he want you to work at you are to partner with god and to figure out what he wants for you not these people these people you're gonna be seven minute news they're gonna talk about you for about seven minutes after that's up they're gonna be on to the next topic so i just wanted to encourage you very short video but full of encouragement that sometimes you got to leave these people places and things behind and get around the people that are doing exactly what it is that you want to do and god will bless it you know but pray pray and ask god am i supposed to be here or is there something else for me a lot of times you'll feel the tug you'll feel the pull because i know i was feeling it i was feeling that tug god was tugging on me he was pulling on me and i was like i don't know why i cannot stay comfortable but it was because it was time to move it was time to grow it was time to expand and so that's what i'm praying for you all that you would take heed to it if it's your time i'm not saying everybody should jump up and leave their salon i'm just saying 
ask God to help you and place you around the right people that are doing better than you because those are the people that you want to talk to once i started talking to people that was doing better than me that was making more money than me it opened up my eyes to the fact that we are in a billion dollar industry and we can make as much money as we want to make it opened up my eyes to the fact that i've been playing small it opened up the, the, my eyes to the fact that i had never given myself a raise um so yeah it's i know that's crazy but that's what it was. And, and if I didn't get around those people that were giving themselves raises, that were making the money, then I, I wouldn't be here today talking to you. So make sure y'all purchase the copy of the book if you don't already have it. It's called Hair Me Out, From Broke to Six Figures with God. It's going to change your life. It's a very short read. You can read it in an hour. But it's going to bless your life. So y'all take care. I love you guys. I'll be back on here with another video soon.